Hey everybody and welcome to the ultimate luxury car, the Mercedes-Benz S600 Maybach Pullman. Now look at this massive car. That's a car for presidents and big VIPs or just collectors who like cars like this. Now look at it. It's huge. Huge but beautiful. We start with the front. Full multi-beam LED headlights. In this particular car, it's an S600 Maybach Pullman and we facelifted the car with Mercedes-Benz to the 2019 exterior optic. So we fit a complete new front bumper from the facelift model, the new headlights, multi-beam, and the new front grille. So you have a lot of chrome here in the front and what is outstanding is the grille with the vertical stripes it looks aggressive, but still not too much because it's a statesman's car. Very beautiful. So if you look through the side, you have two questions maybe. What's this? This one is for the flag. It's a flag holder for the flag. Since it's a, let's say, presidential or at least statesman's car. If you have guests you pick up with this car, you're driving with this car, you want to show your national flag. So on both sides, you have the preparation for a flag holder and you can put your flag on it. Very nice detail, but you have to have it also in this car. And you might see these massive wheels. These are special wheels for the Pullman because the weight is three tons without passengers. So you need a special wheel who can carry all this weight and along together with a long chassis. So you have big special wheels and behind those chrome rims, you have a big brake because you need to have a good brake with a three-ton car at this size. Now the Pullman always comes as a V12 engine, so you have the biggest possible engine from Mercedes for this car. Again, three tons need to be powered by a good engine and the V12 from Mercedes is one of the best. Now the sideline continues as you can see with all the chrome details, the window frames. as well as the door handle and chrome and also the lower part of the doors you have the chrome line and this marker here you have to have it because the car is extra long so you have a side marker um, you know most of these side marker stuff from the US cars but the Pullman also has to have it it's a regulation now and this is where it comes interesting on the Pullman the rear door we're gonna take a look inside later but here you can see where the size goes to completely to the rear compartment. So again, from the back, we also did the facelift and of course updated the name, as you can see. 650 was the newer one, same car but different looks and here we have made the same. Complete new uh, rear bumper with rear lights and the exhaust tips. All LED technology, very beautiful looking, especially at night. Now let's take a quick look at the front compartment where the drivers work. So not bad as a working place, don't you think? Full electric seats with memory, heated and cooled. Burmeister sound system, 3D in the whole car. Of course, full special leather seats with a mark to the engine, V12, of course. And a very nice interior. In this case, we have one of the Maybach interiors with a silk beige and the so-called pearl red. It looks more brown to me, but it's called pearl red from Mercedes. And of course the whole car has soft door close. So the vacuum closing. Now, but now it's getting interesting. Let's take a look at the rear suite.
So welcome to the first class suite in a car. Now, as you can see, I'm sitting, the door is open, but I don't want to close it. I can, very easy. I'm pushing this button. So, and so you can better see inside, let's open the windows. Now, uh, let me give some more light inside. You got the control here. I'm gonna explain to you what it is later, but I want to show you the panoramic roof as well. As you can see, so we got some more light, very nice. But if the sun is shining on a bright day and you don't like it, just push a button and the magic sky gets blue. Here's the button. Now it's blue. With the push of a button, it's white. We leave it like this so you can see better. So let me first of all explain to you. Uh, in the door, you got what you're used to. Seat control, seat ventilation, seat heating, and of course you got the Bowmaster 3D sound system with the boxes which come out when you start the car. But first of all, I want to sit very comfortable. So I'm gonna lift my footrest, as you can see. Because here's enough space and I can really lay down. Oh, this is nice. So now I'm very comfortable, so I'm gonna explain to you the rest of the interior. Now, first of all, in the front of me, you can see two emergency seats, so-called emergency seats, because they are very luxurious. You have a cushion inside the Pullman, of course. Uh, so one seat is folded in and one is folded out. You can also fold the other one in, so you got more space, or if you sit here with four people, you have enough space for everyone. Let me just show it to you. It's again in the center control here. I have two buttons here and here for the right and the left. So let me show you the left one, which is in front of me. When I push this button, just look what the seat does. So uh, we are here in the center console. Let me just show you what else you have. Of course, you've got some tables for the two rear passengers here. So I can work if I want to. I have a laptop, something to eat, to drink, whatever you like. So the possibility is given to work. Normally when you sit at this place, you don't have to. <laughs> As well, you got a remote control. Let me just show you what it's for. Again, I'm activating the seat. So I'm ju just showing you one side, but of course it's on both sides. You got a little screen there. So let me just turn it on. Aha, shows Maybach as well as the big screen. And I have some menu. So I have the navigation system where you can see I can uh, have as well radio or information about the car, whatever you like. If I'm bored, I can play with it something. I'm gonna turn it off now. What else can I steer in the center console? You got some more. We got the seats, we got the panoramic roof, and in the front, we got one for the TV. As you can see over there, there's a big TV. If I don't like it, bye bye. So now, and especially you can see this wall. Now you cannot see through, and that has a good reason because here's privacy. But if I want to see through, I just push a button here. Now look what is happening. Miracle. So I can see the driver, I can see whatever I like. If I want to speak to the driver directly, not about uh, on the intercom system, I can turn the window down. So I have direct contact. But most of the time, I guess it'll stay closed. So I'll leave it like this. What else do we have here? Um, this is the intercom system, so I can communicate with the driver, even when the window is closed, when he should stop or whatever. Or you have here for all the sun blinds to close and to open. And it's a luxurious car. You cannot miss this one. Champagne flutes. You have two. I've just put one. And champagne flute holder, especially with a Maybach symbol. And it's real silver. It's uh, Robert and Birkin silver. You got two flutes and you have here so-called, let's say, champagne flute cup holders. 
fixed, so nothing can happen. If you have something else for the cup holders, you of course have two here, which are cooled, blue, or heated, red. And if you don't need either of those, take it off and close it. You get some nice black wood. Of course, you have air condition as well here. You can manage your temperature, whatever you like. Oh, no, 22, it's better. And again, Maiva, so you know where you're sitting in. Then here you got some little, well, it looks like a smartphone, whoops. It looks like a smartphone, but actually it's like, um, how can I say it? it? Looks like a Blackberry or stuff. But you, you can program like the seats uh, for the massage. You can uh, answer the phone call or whatever. It's like a small display for the car. Um, so you can steer the rear seats or you can prepare the car if you're about to get in. But most of the people will not use it. You got a socket over here or a cigarette lighter over here. Now let's close this one. So, the champagne flutes. If you got the flute, you want champagne. And where do you cool it? Right, in your fridge. So over here, here's the other flute holder. Here's the second one, you can see it. Maybach. You have the fridge over here. There you got space for at least two bottles for cold drinks, whatever you like. And above the fridge, you have the DVD uh, changer for the rear screen. So you can put in a DVD, watch a DVD or whatever you like. Or you just listen to the fantastic sound of the Burmester high-end 3D sound system. But I guess most of the time in these cars, work will be done, decisions will be made, or just somebody will sleep in it. So to let you know how fast you are going and what time it is, you have the gorgeous over here in the headliner. The complete headliner is leather. And here you can see all the necessary information, temperature, time, and the speed you're going to, to tell your driver maybe to slow down. So for the emergency seats, I have something else to show you over here. Just have a look. Um, you have to come here closer. So even for the emergency seats, you got seat heating. Well, at least it's nice. So you can heat both of the seats. Uh, over here is one headset, for example. This is how the headset looks like. And you got some storage over here as well. Small storage, not so big. But again, also with the Maybach symbol here. Very nice made. And the best thing is, to be honest, the cushions here for the head. It's so soft for all four seats. It's very, very nice. And especially on the rear seat where you can lay down. Now, if you fold in both emergency seats and you only sit with two people in the back you can imagine how luxurious it is and you can lay down you can sleep you can close the sun blinds so you're totally for yourself it's like a first class suite in a car so that was the Maybach S600 Pullman uh, I'm going to relax a little bit now more here hope you liked the video if you got any questions or comments please leave them below and I hope to see you next time Thank you.